afternoon, everyone. Today, we're going to discuss another sample format of alarm sheet. And now for missing person. Because before, we have discussed alarm sheet for carnapping incidents, right? So today, alarm sheet for missing person naman. So basically, what is the purpose of this? Ano? If, uh, if a relative or a friend goes missing, it's important to uh, contact the nearest local police. Okay, so you don't, you don't have to wait for 24 hours anymore to report a missing person. If you start to fear for the missing person's personal safety and welfare, then you must report it to the, ne to the nearest police. So as future law enforcers, if a person comes to your desk to report a missing person, this report, uh, this is the report that you're going to do, okay? So, let's have the usual PNP Gapan alarm number 2021. Let's say um, 10. Sample lang So, missing. Let's say missing. Place where last seen. Pwede natin alagay. Let's just invent 7 Eleven. Uh, sa Shell. 7 Eleven Shell Gapan. Date and time. Say, for example, kagabi siya huling nakita, 10, uh, 10, 21, around, uh, let's say, 5 p.m. Kagabi. Name of subject, uh, let's say, Totoy Bibo. So, that's the name of the missing person. Alias, Totoy. Toti, uh, ayan. Address niya, um, Santo Nino, Gapan City. A description. Sex. Okay. Let's say male. Nationality. Filipino. Age. Uh, let's say 21. Complexion. Dark. Height. Let's say 5'7. Weight. Let's say uh, 65 kilograms. Build. Uh, ano bang build niya? Let's say. Uh, thin. Mapayat siya. Oh, hair. Black. Peculiarities with, uh, with mole on the. Neck. Oh, meron siyang nunala sa leeg. And other identification data. Last, you specify anything. Last seen wearing red t-shirt and uh, black shorts. Pwede mo ilagay dyan yun. And particularly kung meron siyang karamdaman o kapansanan, o dito lagay natin with uh, ADHD. Yan. Sabi natin. Para siyang ano, May disorder siya. Photo. Maglagay ka ng photo. Yan. Dito yung sample. Oh, no offense man ta. Nakita ko lang yan sa ano. Nakita ko lang yan sa Facebook. Yan. Additional info. Pwede pala dito ilagay yan. Kung meron siyang uh, sakit or uh, disability, pwede mo siyang ilagay yan. Complainant or informant, si uh, Tetay Biba. Oh, yan naman. Address, the same address, Santo Nino, Gapan City. Telephone number, 0919-999999. Yan. Relationship to the subject. Oh, nari anak niya, son. Reported to other agency? Oh, no. Lagyan natin dito. No. Kung hindi pa. Date and time reported? Nari, today niya ni-report. 10, 11, 2021. Anong oras niya ni-report? Let's say, 7 a.m. Report received by? Kung nari, uh, ikaw yon. You, you state your name. You put your name here. Your name, and then date to day, 10, uh, 11, 2021, 
7 a.m. Position or designation? Uh, police on duty. Sa front desk, let's say, ganon. Okay. This is to certify that the above report data are true and correct to the best of my knowledge. Signature of complainant. Papirmahin mo yung complainant. Signature of Yan. Subscribe and sworn to me this day, today, 11th day of October 2021. Signature, your signature here. Your signature. Issuance of alarm requested by ah, Pwede mong ilagay dito yung your name ulit. Your name, date and time, today ulit, 10, 11, 2021, 7.30, position, Information officer. Issue once requested. Issued by. Pwede mong ilagay dyan yung uh, pangalan mo ulit. Your name ulit. Date and time. Kung ikaw din yung nagbaba ng alarm. 10, 11, 20, 21, 7.30 a.m. Position. Ayan. Information officer. Okay. Lifting of alarm. Itong lifting of alarm na ito ay lalagyan nyo lang ng data once na uh, there is no use of the certain alarm. Kung nyari, uh, kunwari nga natagpuan na yon, Kung nyari, na-recover na o kaya false alarm, nakitulog lang pala sa kapitbahay, bumalik na yung person na yon, or the person is arrested and other specific data. So, sa activity nyo, pwede nyo Punuan pa yan. Alarm lifted by. Pwede ikaw ulit yan. Your name. Etc. Yan. The same goes to this. Requested by. Ayan. Blah, 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 blah. Signature of supervisor. Lagi natin nilalagay na supervisor. Mm. Yan. Date and time. Kung anong date and time ililift yung alarm. Tapos, uh, designation COP. Diba? Yung ganun. So, dito, we're through with this. Sabihin natin na, na nahanap na. Okay? So, person is, oh, person returned. Bumalik bigla. So, ililift mo na yung alarm. Kasi there's no, there's no point of alarming, ano? Because, uh, the person already returned. Bumalik na siya. Ano lang pala siya, ah, uh, Naghanap lang pala siya ng Pokemon. Pwede, di ba? Okay. So, yun lang naman. This is very self-explanatory. Sa, i-highlight ko na lang din yung mga information na dinagdag natin. Para, para, malinawan ko kayo. Ayan. Okay. So, for your activity, ano, you can invent any... Scenario, pwede kayong maglagay ng any description. Wala na akong ilalagay na ibang facts. So long as uh, ma-establish nyo yung alarm for missing person, kahit anong ilagay nyo, kahit anong ilagay nyo yung situation. Kunwari, babae naman yung nawawala, o kaya anong nangyari, natagpuan na, patay na, ganon. Pwede yon, Okay? Huling nakita, kasama ang boyfriend. Okay? Ganyan. Oh. Okay. Ayan. Hinighlight ko lang yung mga nilagay ko na information para for future references, you can use this. Hmm, ayan. Dito, puro pangalan nyo lang naman yan. 
Okay, police on duty. Okay. So, ito, yung report na ginawa natin, this is for missing or want, missing person. Pwede din naman yan, alarm sheet for wanted person. Diba? Kunwari, uh, yung katulong nyo sa bahay, ninakawan kayo, and you want to alarm the authorities na yung kapitbahay nyo tumakas at wanted siya. So, pwede nyo ilagay dyan. Wanted, it's just like nyo siya. Place where last seen, date, time, etc. Okay? So, pwedeng, pwedeng wanted yung gawin niya sa activity nyo, pwedeng missing person katulad nito. Okay? Either of the two. Anyway, so that's all for this uh, session. I hope you have learned something. Please wait for your activity via Edmodo. Thank you and God bless you all.